Hey everybody, how's it going? Hey B Wildcat, hey everybody, hey Nada, everybody out there. Uh, we're going to get into another video today, and today I'm playing All Pro Football 2K8. You may have the game, you may not. It's uh, it's kind of a mix, if you do the season or franchise, between uh, Madden Ultimate Team and a Fantasy Draft. You pick your players, and they're pretty much legends. You pick uh, two Gold Star players, three Silver Star players, and six Bronze Star players. Yes, you do. You pick them, and I kind of picked some pretty interesting players. I take Mark Rippon, Randall Cunningham, Jack Youngblood, uh, Tom Rathman. Uh, I took Dwight Clark. I took John Taylor, and I took um, I took Bill Curry from the Packers. You don't know him. That is, and I took Floyd Little. So we're gonna, and then you have to go pick your type of offensive line. Um, I take a balance because I took Barry Sanders too, so I kind of want a running player too. You see, we're the Oklahoma City Knights, and you get, uh, I believe it's only a 12 game schedule, and it only goes for one year. Oh uh, yeah, it's longer. It's actually a 16 game schedule. Hey guys, so here we are. We're getting into our first game. We're playing. We are playing Seattle, and they are the Seattle Sailors. So we're getting into the stadium here. Uh, I bl uh, no, we're at home. We are. I'm pretty sure at home today. Uh, see, that's the Sailors lineup: fielding Archie Manning. I know who Otis Anderson is. Know who Eric Martin is. I know who all the players I picked are. You can see. You can pause also who I picked when I pick them. Or you can pause at the lineup and read them off. But you see the Sailors are driving. I don't really know too many of their players. So I can't really call them out. If it's a team I know a lot of the players on. Then I'll start calling them out. But fortunately it doesn't even show their name below them. So uh, it only does that for mine. <laughs> so I can tell you who my players are. But, uh, yeah, you can see they're trying to drive in Archie here on third and four. Well, he just fires at 42, just goes right out of bounds. Looks like the fullback. And we have our first injury, so, yeah. Um, But this game's kind of a different style. You see, I chose Randall Cunningham. Look how athletic. Wah! Go away. Uh, but it's a different style. Um, I'm not really sure how PS3 works, but, you know, the sticks? Uh, You have to pull it back and push it forward to throw, like, just boom, boom. That's the only way to throw. It's not like, man, you can't hit the button and it throws it based on how you tap the button. This game was kind of too old for that. Um, No, that determines. Because if you don't do that, then you got a problem. And here I called the Flea Flicker and Randy Cu Randall Cunningham finds Lenny Moore. That's the play Randall Cunningham was famous for in 1998 with the Vikings. His deep bomb on the Flea Flicker. Hand it off to the back. Get the pitch back and just bomb one up there. Cunningham, woo, look at that throw. Nice long one, and Moore just had enough space between him and the defender. That leads to seven points. And Archie Manning gets sacked like he did a lot with the New Orleans Saints back in the uh, 70s and all, when they pretty much sucked. <laughs> yeah, believe it, there was a time when the Saints pretty much stunk it up. But uh, Sailors are trying to drive here. And, uh, let me know, guys, if you want me to, uh, turn the difficulty up on this game. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, you can see there we, uh, I believe we jump, yep. Neutral zone infraction or something, I don't know. Um, but, yeah. Turn me, tell me if you want to turn the difficulty up, or if you think it's fine. I might play the next game on this difficulty just to see what the score is. If it's way out of hand, I mean, not saying this one's going to be out of hand, but I'm just saying... If the next one's going to be a big 35 dunking, But it looks like, you know, we're pretty dominant here on the offense. And this team just can't stop us. There's another penalty as Randall Cunningham got a first down. But uh, that one's coming back for clipping on number 71 of the Knights. So that stinks. And that would actually end the half. We just go to the half after that. Really wouldn't try for much more. And you're going to see the halftime show. And these are the halftime stats. So you can pause there and see how we did in the first half. And we're coming out in the second half and handing off to Barry Sanders. Gets a good eight yards on that play. Hand off Tom Rathman on short yard situations. The powerful back from the 49ers. You see that replay. Woo, he just goes right through there and it's like, nah. Just going to force you to go with. Carry some guys on his back. Another flea flicker chance, but Randall Cunningham takes off this time as he did as an eagle. 
Gets the first down just barely. Cunningham under center. Back to throw. Randall Cunningham fires that one. Finds Dwight Clark. Uh, that Randall Cunningham doesn't throw very pretty throws, I'm not going to lie. And there you see Barry Sanders bounces outside from the inside. Breaks a tackle, which gives him 9 yards on first and 10. Hand off Barry Sanders behind Tom Rathman. Tom Rathman gets the first man and Sanders makes it second inches. But after Rathman would lose a yard... Comes third and one, and Randall Cunningham tries to get the first down athletically. He makes it fourth and inches. All right, here we go. Quarterback sneak by Cunningham. Athletic quarterback, only inches to go. Not a bad choice. And Cunningham here goes, fires it. Lenny Moore gets it down to the goal line. You see the quarterback comparisons. Here on the goal line, yeah, you know what we're going to do here? It's kind of obvious. Boom, Tom Rathman goes up the middle. Huge holes. The sign goes off and says, touchdown. Home is up 13 to nothing. Boom, Tom Rathman just goes through. But on the extra point, uh, the extra point meter is kind of weird. You have to hold the stick down, and then just before you kick it, you push it up. It's uh, it's pretty weird, and uh, I miss quite a bit. So that's why I don't like kicking field goals. So I miss that extra point, which is kind of embarrassing, but it's... It happens to the best of us. And look at that. Wide open on third and nine. He hears footsteps and drops it. Fourth and nine. Boom. That's going nowhere. And Randall Cunningham and the Knights will take off. Cunningham goes, rolls. Yes. Gets some good yards. Five yards. Handoff. Sanders goes up the middle. Gets good yardage there. First down on the Sailors 36-yard line. Cunningham back to throw. Finds Dwight Clark into the red zone. We go. Cunningham hands off Sanders going up the middle. Good. It's about nine and a half yards. Third and inches. Cunningham back to throw. Nope. Cunningham's going to roll out. They should begin him right here, right? Cunningham breaks the first tackle. And boom. Cunningham is in. And we decide we're going to go for two here. Mark Rippon, though, gets sacked. I just wanted to make it a three touchdown game. But now it's 19 nothing with under two minutes, so the game's pretty much out of reach, but the Sailors are going to try anyway, and they get a nice gain there. So RG Manning, you know him. He's never going to give up. But, uh, yeah. So, yeah, what are the Sailors going to do? They're going to go find another man deep down the field, driving another penalty. RG Manning breaks off the first tackle and misses that throw. If it weren't for the offsides penalty, then we would have him in fourth and eight instead third and three. And Archie Manning finds his touchdown pass. You see Archie Manning stands in the pocket and boom. Throws a little bit of a wobbler to number 19. But that ends the game 19-7. to So you're going to see the stats. But yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed this series. And uh, yeah, guys, uh, Wildcat, hope you do well on your channel. Hope you become a big channel. And I will see all my subs and all my new guys. Please. Rate, like, sub, whatever, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.